please don't believe what you see on social media and try to cook your cinnamon rolls on your next camping trip like this. After wasting 10 minutes of roasting them slowly to try to get the perfect cook, they'll start to get really squishy on the inside and you won't even be able to hold them on your roasting fork. When you take them off, they're still going to be raw inside. But don't worry, I've got four ways that actually work to cook delicious cinnamon rolls while you're camping. Number four is our family's favorite, but they all work well. The first way is to use a cast iron pie iron. I will tell you the first two methods do use cast iron cookware. If you don't have that in your camping toolkit, then skip ahead to methods three and four, which require no special tools whatsoever. Cinnamon rolls cook up perfectly in a pie iron because they get a little bit brown on the top and bottom and they cook all the way through just like they would in the oven. You can spray them with cooking spray or in this case, I line them with aluminum foil. The only reason I do this is if I don't wanna use a plate later, it works as a plate and I don't get any sticky icing on my pie iron, which is a pain to clean up later. There's no rawness here, they cook up perfectly. Method number two is to use a cast iron Dutch oven. The benefits of this is that you can fit all eight cinnamon rolls at once. Simply place your Dutch oven over some campfire coals or pieces of charcoal and then add some coals to the top. This will allow it to act like an oven and bake those cinnamon rolls all the way through. Use the parchment paper to lift them out all at the same time and then slather them with icing. They'll be delicious. Method three requires no fancy cooking supplies, but you will need some orange peels. You're gonna take out all the segments from the inside. You're going to be able to fit two cinnamon rolls in each orange peel. Wrap them up well in aluminum foil and place them in campfire embers or on top of charcoal. Now the orange peel does get burned, but the cinnamon rolls inside stay super moist and they also take on a slightly orange flavor. They're really good. You can eat them straight out of the orange peel after you top them with icing. Method number four is simply to roast your cinnamon rolls over the fire like you would a s'more. We can use a stick or a roasting fork for this, but there are a couple of tricks to make it work well. First, you wanna make sure that your cinnamon roll goes on in a single layer. So you should unravel it and put it on in one layer so that it cooks all the way through. I found that Pillsbury rolls, although they taste better, don't actually unroll as well as some of the off-brand ones like the Aldi ones. So we usually get those if we're gonna be roasting on a stick. Also, be sure to attach the ends together so that they don't flap around while you're spinning your fork or your stick. All that's left is to cook them over a small campfire or over campfire coals for about 10 minutes. You'll wanna try to keep them rotating during this. Kids aren't usually patient enough to make this work, but you could still give it a try. They do burn, but they don't burn as easily as a marshmallow, which is great. Once they're done, they'll be cooked all the way through without any raw pockets, and all you need to do is add icing right to that stick and eat it straight from there. No matter which way you choose to cook cinnamon rolls on your next camping trip, I promise it's going to be better than this way. Thanks so much for watching. Follow along for tons of recipes, renovations, and hacks to make camping as comfortable as home.